Modern production plants are rightly associated with conveyor belts. They guarantee a smooth manufacturing process. They play a special role in the food industry, where not only does the production speed matter, but also strict sanitary standards apply. How are they produced? To answer this question, we have visited Modern Plast, a company specializing in modular conveyor belts. Most often we see them in meat processing plants. They consist of many modules connected with each other using plastic pins, characterized by high resistance to tensile forces during the modular belt operation. Individual modules are made of a special mixture of plastics, i.e. polypropylene, polythene and polycetyl. They are resistant to the penetration and absorption of body fluids from meat and thus to bacteria and biofilm development. Tapes are non-adhesive. The antibacterial material does not lead to the development of bacterial cultures or biofilm formation. The reason is the substance applied which eliminates the possibility of bacteria growth and development. To illustrate this, a standard conveyor belt has micropores inside its structure, thanks to which it absorbs these bacteria or plasma inside the belt. As a result, foci of bacteria are created inside the belt. Such a situation is impossible in the case of antibacterial belts, as there are no micropores in the material. It all starts with a module design. The type of transported products, speed of movement, anti-slip properties and color are taken into consideration. Firstly, the module is designed and then the mold for the injection molding machine. Once the mold design is ready, we start the production of modules. Modern Plast receives antibacterial granules supplied by an external manufacturer. It is automatically taken into the injection molding machine tank. The material goes through a gravimetric dye dispenser, which measures the volume of the delivered granulate and, at the same time, sets the right temperature. Then it enters the next device system, which turns the granulate into a liquid mass and presses it under the appropriate pressure through the screw into the mold. Several hundred tons of clamping force of the injection molding machine turns the material into a finished product. Everything takes about 30 seconds. Finally, it is time for quality control checks. The plant manufactures from 20 to 50,000 small parts per month, modules, pins and gears. In total, Modern Plast produces components from several dozen injection molds. Once the modules leave the production stage, they enter the assembly table, where they are joined together. Here, depending on the order, they are arranged in a form of the appropriate length and width. They are then connected with the use of pins. In this way, several hundred meters of modular belts are produced monthly. Then it is time for meticulous quality control in terms of their dimensions and hardness using a hardness tester. Ready? And how do modern plast belts work in practice? In this plant, they are used to transport raw and packaged poultry. Most of those are a width of 200 millimeters, which transport fillets. Vertical rise, arched, open work and anti-slip belts were installed here. Tape versions for transporting packaging can be interlaced and finely scaled as well. As a result of the use of this type of transporters, Food manufacturers can apply for the Guarantee Food Quality Certificate QAFP, in a more effective way. Thanks to the QAFP system, meat processing plants can provide their customers with healthier products with a longer shelf life.
we can enjoy tasty meat products meeting strict sanitary standards.